and now this is starting insulin therapy and in this there is a patient mrs kathleen and she has type 2 diabetes and she is on maximal uh, oral hypoglycemic except she could not tolerate uh, metformin and his hba1c levels are high 13.4 percent and so, so doctor start needs to start insulin now your task is to discuss the present glycemic control and recommend insulin and address her concerns okay so now in this stage uh, before proceeding this skill you should have in your mind that you have to pursue the patient to take insulin okay so now the patient is scared and you have to address you have to appreciate her concerns regarding it and as well as address her concerns empathetically um, okay now first of all introduce okay hello good morning i am dr rais one of the doctor in the diabetic clinic are you mrs kathleen okay nice to meet you ma'am uh okay well i understand that uh, you have uh, diabetes which is not uh, well controlled and although you are on many medications for that is that correct okay patient will say okay yes then tell i am here to discuss with you about your diabetic control and what we can do further is that okay okay so before i proceed further will you tell me that how are you feeling now she will tell you about her symptoms osmotic symptoms she will tell you and uh, whatever she tells listen to it okay and keep on uh, expressing your concerns and uh, give pay full attention and then tell her that uh, okay i appreciate that uh, uh, you know well about your uh, that, that uh, you you know well about your disease and uh, our diabetic team is worried that your diabetic control sugar control is not high, uh, very good and hba1c levels are high so then again silence then see her response and if she wants to know to know more then keep on telling the micro and macro vascular complications of diabetes okay in uh, you know all what are the macro vascular and micro vascular complications of diabetes and uh, then if she we now uh, li little bit make her scared of the complications of diabetes okay because when she will be scared she will think to uh, take insulin and uh, she will listen to you as well uh, and now when you explained all the complications then she may ask okay doctor what uh, how i can control or what you can do further then tell him Uh, tell her that it is common for such patients that we are giving him we are starting them over insulin how do you feel about it then again silence see her response and if she is uh, keen then okay very good but if she is not keen then explore reasons with empathy uh, would you could you tell me the reasons why you are not interested to take insulin okay so like this and uh, whatever she says tell her that you appreciate her concerns now reassure the patient okay because insulin is 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 in our best interest and we want to pursue the patient and also this is our task as well so tell her that insulin is uh, suggested in her best interest to control his di diabetes as well as to prevent the complications and uh, then tell her that insulin treatment has improved and many patients are doing very well after insulin and if she says doctor i have needle phobia uh, then then okay say her okay well i appreciate your concern and there are ways to overcome it one way is that that you come to the diabetic center and one of the nursing staff will demonstrate you how to use it then number 2 how to then tell her that if you are you are incapable of self administering insulin then a district nurse can do that for you or even a relative can be taught to do it is it okay okay so and if if she ask any side effects then be very honest and tell her that there are risks for insulin treatment such as uh, patients may get uh, uh, low blood sugars many uh, low blood sugar episodes but reassure her that uh, reassure her that this could be minimized by regular monitoring of blood sugars and we will tell you the ways how to adjust it like uh, as we know how to combat the hypoglycemia like take regular insulin at regular level and don't miss a snack and uh, you should be aware of hypoglycemic symptoms and this all this all it will come in the next uh, 
communication skill and i will tell you in detail okay and uh, so like this you have uh, you are you are please try to uh, pursue her and emphasize with the delicacy and even if she is uh, that insulin is, is important and uh, and uh, re reassure her and tell her that uh, as your hb1c your levels are high and your diabetic control is poor so insulin is inevitable it has it, it could be deferred for a couple of months but not more okay if she asked doctor are there any other therapies then tell her yes there are other therapies like glp1 agonist uh, and these are also injectable but as you are having symptoms and uh, high hba1c levels so these drugs are unlikely to improve your control okay and insulin is the best next recommended step and uh, however if still she doesn't agree for the insulin then tell her okay i will uh, uh, give you more information about it and uh, you can and then do the end like recap you recap patient recap and follow up helps and like this all you have to do please like share and subscribe my youtube channel for more videos thank you